And hit. Oh, Bamiang! The captain scores! Well, it's so hard to keep someone with his enthusiasm. Three hours later. Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. really is a great venue, it adds so much character to every game it stages. Brentford have gone 4-3-3, can you interpret that? Yeah Peter, you can look at this formation one minute and think that it is 4-3-3 and the next time you check it will be 4-5-1 and it's all to do with whether you've got the ball or not and the wider attacking players being asked to apply defensive discipline too. When it does turn to a five across midfield, then the shape of this team takes on a much tidier, compact defensive look. And that gets things running. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Well, a man who splits opinion, David Luiz. Is he a midfielder or a defender? I would say former because he has an impetuous streak that can't be trusted at the back but full of resilience there and, and what a shot yeah i'm inclined to agree it's a loose ball Tierney. oh that is lovely footwork in comes the cross i just couldn't quite turn it in no, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. The play, and it is a goal kick. Seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. So it is still nil-nil. Janssen. Jensen, Jensen, plays it forward. Odegaard, forward it goes. Just brushed off the ball there. Odegaard. Looks to clip it forward. It's Pepe! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Pepe, he caught it well enough, but that was never really going to trouble the keeper. And it's played forward. If anyone is going to break the deadlock, now would be a good time. De Silva. Hector Berry. Odegaard. And hit. Oh, Bamiang! The captain scores! Well, it's so hard to keep someone with his enthusiasm and his energy quiet. Second best will never be accepted in the world he lives in, and the timing of his goal won't be lost on him. It's crucial. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. There 
since the half-time whistle. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. Rumble still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. And more than decent game up to now. Well, they show glimpses of some wonderful football to go. That gets things going for the second half. Arsenal doing well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Ceballos. And here's... Oh, Bamiyan hits it! Oh, real danger here! William. And here's Oba going for goal! Cleared without complication. Odegaard doesn't have an assist to his name. Pepe, it's Pepe! He scores! A two-goal cushion and it's looking safe! That was glorious, pinpoint accuracy. You know, what was notable in that, Peter, was the fact that he didn't try to blast it, he chose placement instead and delivered a peach. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Arsenal take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition it already has actually yeah his instinct and the timing of his runs have proven fruitful but they have to give him a harder time like that Pepe provides an outlet Pepe oh it looked like three nil for sure Pepe clearly is aware of how important that was he'll be hoping that it won't come back to haunt him He's had that put on. Oh, Bamiyan hits it! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Well, one sloppy lapse like that can do a lot of damage, and it was triggered by the closing down. Henry. Two minutes to be added on. Partey plays it out to the flank. Pepe, he's left his man. Time to deliver. Now has a hit. Away from immediate danger. And that is that. So they have their win. They had all the answers to whatever the opposition threw at them. And the result followed inevitably. So Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Arsenal simply made their superiority count. They found cruise control quite early and, and didn't.